Hi, welcome to LB0 Fox India Norwegian Hem Ventures. I'm Morton, LB0 Fox India. And yes, I know I'm a little bit late to the game. What I have in front of me are two mesh tastic devices, and I haven't really played around with mesh tastic at all. But Elecro reached out to me a while ago and asked if I wanted to test something completely different, which was cool enough. I don't even remember what it was, but it was something cool but not relevant for the channel so i saw they had these two uh meshtastic kits here and i asked kindly if i could have those for review and here they are i'll leave some links down below to elecro and these are not affiliate links i do not get a cut from these i have no idea how these devices are i've just opened the cardboard box they came in and put them on my desk and pressed record so let's take a look at these we have the oh i need just so everything's right, we have the ThinkNote M1 and the ThinkNote M2. Both are LoRa devices, both are Meshtastic devices. The M1 has an e-paper screen and the uh, M2 has an OLED screen and is a little bit smaller. Um, what I think we're going to do today is we're going to take a quick look at these. Um, then I'm going to probably set them off, set them up off screen, and we're going to see if we can send some messages back and forth between these. As I said, I am new to Meshtastic, haven't played around, but let's start with the M1 here and uh, open it up. And the case is it's a plastic box inside this cardboard here. Looks good. Um, just the way it's supposed to be. Let's see, we get a little bit of a booklet here. It's so-called user manual. Doesn't really say much. We might need that later on. We have an antenna for 868 megahertz, I suppose. We have a USB-C cable for charging. And we have the M, this is the M1 device. I need to take a look at that. Um, let's take a look at it. Um, antenna port, uh, on off display brightness, um, encoder here, as far as I've understood, we have a GPS on off. We have a couple of functions buttons and that's about it. Let's remove the plastic here. And then take the antenna out and then we'll do the same with the M2. And, um, what I'm going to do when we've unboxed and taken a look at these, we're going to, I'm going to set these up off screen because I've haven't really played around with Meshtastic and doing it the first time. Um, just, I'm not the person to tell you how to do these things. So we got this with the e-paper screen. Let's take a look at the M2 and see how that looks. Put the cable here and shuffle things around my desk here. The M2, same kind of packaging. Let's open it up and see. We got a so-called user manual here as well. It says pretty much the same. Um, we have the device here. USB cable, and that's about it. So we're going to just put this off screen as well. Um, this one has an OLED screen. Uh, internal or built-in antenna, non-removable antenna. Um, two buttons on the side here. Besides that, nothing too different. So two meshtastic devices here from Elecro. Um, so what I'm going to do now, I'm going to set these up off screen and then we'll take a look at, <laughs> take a look and see if they work at all. Um, I really want to give Meshtastic a go because I think it's it's a gateway drug to radio for people who aren't licensed. It's it's a way of unlicensed people actually getting to play around with radio and antennas and stuff. It's like CB, but for twenty for the twenty twenties. Anyhow, I'll be back in a little while, and with the magic of video editing, I'll be right back for you. So I managed to set everything up. Uh, the M2 is connected to my uh, Retroid, um, Retroid Pocket 5. It's a portable game console that runs Android. Um, I've shown in a previous video how you can uh, do FT8 on this one and uh, prove that FT8 is a game. And the M1 is connected to my iPhone here. So let's see if we can send a message here and see what happens. I'm just going to type test. 
and the thingy beeps a lot. See if I push uh, stop beeping here. It says test on the display. I'm not sure if that shows up. And uh, it says test in the window here. So let's go ahead and type test back. Test back. And we got test back and got it here. Let's see if we can press one of the buttons here and make it stop. So we managed to get a message going through uh, both of these devices. Um, I think that's about how much I'm going to test it now. What I'm going to do, though, is I'm going to bring um, one of these notes with me, probably the M1, uh, going around the neighborhoods, the town, to work and back the next couple of days and see if actually anyone can spot me on Meshtastic. So let's see how that works. At least I'm here now. I've started my... I don't know if it's going to be a deep dive, but I've started looking at Meshtastic. So let's see how fun it is. Let me know if you want to see more Meshtastic content. Leave a comment down below. If you like this video, thumbs up. Didn't like it, thumbs down. You know the drill. And also, please do consider subscribing. I'm Morton, LB0 Fox India. I'll see you down the bands. I'll see you in my next video with either ham radio content or the gateway drug to ham radio, Meshtastic. 7-3-L.